Hi, my name is Ari with El Paso Community College and this is DegreeWorks. DegreeWorks is a perfect tool for students to stay on track with their academic goals. Log in by going to my.epcc.edu. Once you have logged in, you can see the DegreeWorks homepage. At the top of the page, you can see all your information such as your current GPA, degree, and major as well as the academic status and declared catalog year. Just below the top section is a cool feature known as the progress bar. This feature visually represents your current degree progress. Keep in mind this bar will only reach 100% after you graduate. It is encouraged that students confirm it with their counselor or advisor if they are registered for all the courses needed for their specific degree plan. Next, the degree requirement breakdown is listed. Here, we can see which classes have been taken and which are needed to graduate. For this example, the student's degree requirements have not been met as indicated by the red blocks. The completed tasks are in the yellow blocks and display with a green check mark. Courses in progress are shown in a blue box with a blue tilde. If you scroll further down, we can see a detailed breakdown of all the degree requirements needed for your specific degree plan. Remember, all degree plans are different. Here, you can see the course requirements and you can also see that calculus still needs to be taken. Let's click on this course and here you can see the course information from the catalog, including the course description and the courses available for the upcoming semester. Make sure to write down the CRN numbers to prepare for the next step. If we continue down the page, you can see the major course breakdown. This student only has one of those courses completed, indicated by the yellow blocks and green check mark. If you scroll down further, you will see a section displaying the courses that are not used. This section shows all the courses taken that the student received credit for, but don't count towards the selected degree plan. In this student's case, it's computer science. The next section displays insufficient courses. This lists all the courses that were dropped or failed and which the student will not receive credit for. Lastly, you can see the courses not counted. For example, in this degree plan, this course was taken at another university and does not count for the current degree plan or the courses are developmental education courses that are not applied in the degree plan. And that pretty much wraps up DegreeWorks. We hope that this gives you a better insight on how to use this tool to complete your academic goals. Stay home, stay safe, and we will see you soon, Tejanos.